YouTubers. Today I got the son of YP Smart Switch and I am going to show you how you can control your appliances like a light allow, a light, a light, a what. I meant lights, the light over here with your Google Home. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel with the bell notifications turned on with the thumbs up button and why we wasting time? Let's get started. Let us see the components needed for this project. First, we need the son of basic Wi-Fi smart switch. I'll unbox this later in this video. Next, the Google Home. I am using a Google Home Mini for this project. Next, the bulb or any other electric equipment of your choice. Next, we need a bulb holder. This You will require this if you are using a bulb. Next, you need a the 2 pin AC plug and some spare wires. Let us unbox this smart switch. This is the son of basic Wi-Fi smart switch. My father bought it for about rupees 500 that is about 7 dollars from Amazon. This device can work with Amazon Alexa, the Google Assistant, the Nest and Ift many more. It works from 90 volt to 250 volts AC with maximum current rated at 10 amps and you can control electrical equipments up to 2200 watts. This is a Chinese device. You can use the EVLink app which is a free universal smart home remote control software. With the EVLink app you can remote control equipments on or off from anywhere. Set scheduled timers to turn on or off. Share control. Control your smart home together with your family. Use smart scene turn on or off devices with one tap for example Devices can be triggered on or off by a temperature sensor. Let us open this box. Inside you have the smart switch. The user manual. The warranty card and a set of screws. Altogether, this is a 3-in-1 device. Number 1. You can control equipments using this push button switch. Number 2. You can remote on or off by the EVLink app. Number 3. Voice control equipments on or off using Google Home. This side is the input. You have to connect the neutral and the line AC inputs here. Be cautious with the polarity. In the output, the output right here, you connect the electrical equipment of your choice. This is the overall setup diagram. You have details on downloading the EVLink app. Examples of how you can connect various electrical devices like a fan, LED bulb, etc.
this is my completed setup. You can see the green Wi-Fi LED blinking. Press this Wi-Fi switch continuously for 7 seconds to enter Wi-Fi mode. You can use this push button to switch on or off the electric bulb. I will show you how to add our smart device into the EVLink app. Now let us see how to link our smart device with Google Home. As I said earlier, this is a 3-in-1 device. Number 1, you can control equipment using this push button switch. Number 2, we can remote on or off using the EVLink app. Number 3, Voice control equipments on or off using Google Home. Hey Google, turn on Harris device 1. Show sure. turning on Harris device 1. Hey Google, turn off Harris device 1. Alright, turning off Harris device 1. Let us play a little with our project. You can see the status in the app as well as the Google Home. Hey Google, is Harris device 1 on or off? Harris device 1 is on. You can see the status of device change. Hey Google, is Harris device 1 on or off? Harris device 1 is off. Hey Google, turn on Harris device 1. Alright, turning Harris device 1 on. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Stay tuned for my next video. Hey Google. Turn off Harris device 1. Sorry, I don't understand. Hey Google. Turn off Harris device 1. Alright, turning off Harris device 1.